Guys, we're on Falling Creek Park in Bedford, Virginia. Me, Brody, and Paula are about to play around. Oh, Paul's going four hands only. Oh my god, did he do it? Drop. Yeah, it's perfect. Oh, definitely stay in the middle the entire round. Yeah. That just has to get around the tree that's quite big. Now on the tee from Good, Virginia, Hannah McBeth. Zoom on this one. Get around it. Get around it. Oh, it caught the back side of the tree. Up. Oh. Nice. Nice. Hey, what did Paul get? You got Bernie. It was a tap in, but it was like 11 foot tap in. It was a, yeah. It was a stretch. Technically, C1X. Also, if anyone asks, I'm taking it easy. Oh, okay. I have to take it easy for one more week because of uh, the juice. Juice? You don't want your muscles to pop with all the steroids. Oh my god. <laughs> Good though. A little like more height and it goes so much further. Yeah, a little bit height. That's where I freaking aim at the basket and not the road. I'm just gonna pop it. Just threw a really great Good. shot. Brody wasn't recording and I who missed Paul's wait, shot. Hold on. I need to know who gives someone a phone already recording. Does anyone there might be people out there? I'm not that person. Are you that person? All right, Hannah probably has about 35 feet here. Little downhill lie, and she just cashes that one in. Nice birdie. Oh, she hit the line. Not enough juice, though. Oh, that's money. Oh. It was like two feet too far. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, not enough turn this time. A little too high. I think you're just trying to throw it too hard from a standstill. Forehand. With the Luna, huh? Not my first choice of disc, but she... Nice! Okay, but you can do this. Oh! Classic Paul Macbeth. Oh yeah. Perfect. Yeah, you kind of want to go turn over at the tree on the left, the cedar, and let it fade right, fade right, fade right, and then just right at the bushes, hides right out just in front of them. Is it turning right? No, he did not get the motion. That's insane. What? You got a putt. Ah, aim point way off, but that was it. Yep. Left side of the fairway. Just throwing a little upshot there. With the crystal luna. I like that. She's gonna have a putt. All right, I don't want much glide. Mm -hmm. 
So I'm thinking a backhand jawbreaker. Okay. And just letting it get close. I'm not thinking about making this, I'm just thinking about getting a par. If I was to say, I would say with the, the flex one, just because it's more of a stable, but it's whatever you're comfortable with. Like oh, if you're yeah, not comfortable with that flex one. enough. Yeah, so. Yeah. So this is probably a flex. Yeah. Once I get comfortable with mm -hmm. it, but for right now, it's probably this. Yeah. I already made my putt and then these guys are basically just getting to tap in and they're just grabbing some practice shots. That's nice. Good shot. Prototype coming soon. Oh, Brody! Yeah, I think you're throwing it too hard so your timing's all off. Do this far. At, at, at this point, yes. This is Paul's drive, sorry, I forgot to record it. No one's surprised. It was really good for forehand. So good. Oh, real short. Oh. A little height? Come on, come on. Big skit? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh, Paul. Come on. I think that's just one tree too early. Oh, but it got through. Oh, that's part two. Looks a little, doesn't look like it's turning. Paul did not record my upshot with the Crystal Luna, which is there. Freaking go! Well, we're not killing this thing, but we're not, we're not doing terrible. Where the heck is the basket? Oh my, this is like a terrible for a play. There. Just lean over it. Yep. Just lean your core. Yep, there you go. Look how much hyzer you got on that thing. Get through. Get through them. Alright. <gasps> wow, that was like that thing was Yeah. Oh, fancy. Such a hard flick. Guys, hard shot. I might get my first birdie. Dude, you said you got to put a lot of aim on it. Gives it a good effort. Oh, it just hit the limb. Okay, Paul now behind the tree, outside the circle, and just short as well. Brody Smith taking yes. the box and yes. the solo birdie all to himself. Yes. You're on hole 10. Yeah. Yep. Oh, oh no. Iser. Two base? Definitely has a distance. Bring it around town. That's parked. Oh my gosh. Oh, that was bad form. Oh. So hard for oh, a flick. Way too early. Just 
bat. Shot of the day. Nice. Paul is in this bush. Might go in. Never mind. Just outside of circle two. <gasps> oh, great throw. Sorry, zone. Zone. Yeah, I feel for him. Oh, come on. Come on. No, I crushed it. Yeah, if you go under, yeah, if you go under that tree, and you, it'll skip up a little bit. But the only thing is, you have to keep it low and what not hit the tree. Go here, I had to go back. I would go forehand, but if I had to go backhand, I would go, go forehand. What would you throw forehand? Uh, the probably, zone? Yeah, more of a stable one though, and I would focus more on the angle. So you almost aim it at that tree on the right, let it turn left, and then flex back. Yeah. The height is probably like ten feet. Yep. So a little higher. Yep. Maybe. Yeah. Let's turn it over. A little speckle color. There it is. Oh, you already threw. So if I was in this situation, I would enter over here. So I can back up my butt? Kind of. Um, just because I see this biggest open gap right here. What I would do is I'd sneak in through here, and then I'd put one knee almost by the sprite can, and then stretch out my other foot through there. And kind of a gap. Just poke it right through here. Yeah. And just get close. So this is where it helps not to be 6'5"? Yeah. <laughs> but you might not, you can almost stretch it from there since you're 6'5". This is people, looking good. People think Brody's not dedicated. But yeah. Ah! There's a little gap there! <laughs> That's a circle so you can go forward after you throw it. Oh. Don't fall forward. No, he can't. He's not playing the circle. Okay. This is where you can... <gasps> Park it. it. Yes. All right, hole four, 15, 14, hole 14. 220 straight ahead. Let's head a little left. Paul's going with the zone, which I actually kind of like here. Forehand hard, misses it, but hits the one behind it. Right in the middle. Why am I trying to make that? Yeah. Oh no, I didn't get a birdie. Oh, it's really starting to rain. Let's go. We only have a few left. See where she's throwing it? Yeah. Just a little bit more right than that and letting it finish is where you want to be. You, yeah, you can go over with the onyx. Okay. Oh no, no, get up. Get up. Dang it. That's way not the right way. Like Anheuser? Straight like up over the tall Anheuser. You see the tallest tree out there? The yeah. tallest twig? Straight down from there, like in line with that, but just in that grassy area. Honestly, I have no idea what to do now. Who am I doing? Yeah. Just back to the knee. I'll just like a little ante up over the treetops and let it flex out. Oh, come back. Dang, that's going so far. <laughs> that was it. Just turn it over. 
So right now it looks like Paul's having him pitch out and just play up and down for a bogey. These are things that a lot of people don't normally practice, so it's cool to see him taking it so seriously. And that is really good. Oh, wow. Oof. Dang it, the disc is wet and it slipped out of my hand. Roller. It's because you put your elbow so far out. Keep coming. Nice. Rowdy. See, you took out, you took all those trees out of play, and now you're in the wide open field. This is kind of a hard one to film because it's like you're just throwing into that. Yeah. Oh no, that's garbage. Okay. Good. Oh. Oh no! It just dropped straight down. Oh, that's so good. Oh! I'm gonna throw my shot and you probably won't see it because we've got to hurry up. Yeah, so Brody's first shot was there. Second shot, par. Here's Paul for par. Oh. Wait, was that for par? Huh? That was for par? Yeah. Ooh. Big rounder. Oh. Okay, so my timing is way off when I go hips first. Because your hips are already opening now. So now on this one, think about pulling. Like, do it the same way you did, but think about pulling it faster with your arm. Mm. So now you can pull it through faster. Yeah. But you can rip one from the fairway up here. Yeah, I might rip one down. I. Nice. Oh, I was about to have a really good line when you made it. I was going to say, trees don't affect him. <laughs> oh! No, no, she, that was a uh, deceleration. Are you learning a lot? I'm learning a ton. I'm learning a lot because I'm throwing nothing but forehand. This is actually probably, in my career, my first ever all forehand round. Wow. Except for putting. So any chance been a putt, it's been... Normal, everything that's not been a play. Should, forehand. Should I do a score update? Yeah. Okay, going into the final hole, Paul with the commanding four under lead, or sorry, down four down. Classic. Hannah, one down, and the Brody and oh, I Hannah two battle down, and then continues. I got that bogey. I'm even, so yeah. Hannah's got me by one shot. It's Ooh, so that putt would have kept the tie right yeah, there. Yeah, it would have definitely. That oh, was, no. He's yeah. only made two mental mistakes. Yeah. Fair, we haven't had 
lunch. So I'm blaming it on that. All right, hold. All right, final hole. Let's get all, hold it's, 20. It's, it's let's all go. birdie. It's we all have birdie. We haven't had an all birdie hole. Come on. It's like let's all, let's all focus in. You, you guys did not high five, so you guys are like bad sports. Oh. Look at this little tee pad. James Conrad is shaking. Come on, skip in there for me. Oh, what do you mean James Conrad shaking? Look at all this. Oh, yeah, I guess you can use all that. You like the buzz here? Uh, I think you need to go. Malta? No, buzz is probably bad. I think it's a driver distance, but yeah, go for the buzz. Hard buzz, yeah. Because it's slightly uphill, I think. It won't oh, fly straight over the basket. Yeah. So if Brody makes this, he puts the pressure on Hannah. She's sitting about 40 feet right here. Come on! Does this guy have the clutch gene? Come on! One under, baby, with a birdie. She's been watching our videos too much. She was going for the skip shot. Okay, so Paul. Five under one. Circle five one. Under. I was that was pretty far. Pretty far. Like, skip shot for before me through this hard time in my life. And then uh, cooped up for going on three weeks, soon to be four, and then finally I'll be back at it. Man, next, you can next, be upset with a five under forehand round. only round. With a boot. He can and he will. How did you feel about your trip? Did you love it? It was actually a lot of fun. Uh, I feel like me and Harry bonded a lot. But uh, yeah, 10 for 10 challenge. I think we just got challenged, by the way. Oh, wait, what happened? 10, ten minis, Ooh. 10 feet, 10 seconds. What if you don't have 10 minis? Oh, trust oh, me, we, we have did. way more than All right, time. well, I know what Paul's doing the rest <laughs> of the day. <laughs> All right, see you in Arizona.